splish splash, I was taking a bath. Oh, that was Saturday night. Scrub a dub dub, just relaxing in the tub. Da -da 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 -da. So for the last several months I've been enrolled in the Dell Carnegie course here in Dickinson. Uh, recently I missed my graduation, so I wanted to show you guys what my speech was actually going to be. Ladies and gentlemen, for the last nine weeks I've been working on a project with the company that I'm employed with. Uh, the project has been to improve and come up with new ideas to collaborate between our remote locations and our main facility in Dickinson. So the problem that we have is we use software that utilizes a large amount of bandwidth when you're trying to transfer graphics back and forth between locations. So what we did was we brought the team together and sat down and discussed what what the root causes were of this problem and how we could resolve those. Um, the real issue is having people in remote locations that just shouldn't be there if they need to collaborate more with other users. So obviously we can't relocate all these people. By utilizing some of the techniques we learned in Dell Carnegie and empowering the actual people who are affected by this to help us come up with these decisions, so we were able to figure out a software solution to help us with this problem. In the end, we resolved the issue. The people who were affected by it are also the people who felt like they were the ones that came up with the solution which in the end really empowered them to make sure this project succeeded and going forward will also help ensure that they have ownership of this and really makes it more difficult for something to fail when someone's responsible for implementation and coming up with the actual solution. Now as far as what I've learned in Dell Carnegie, I think the most important thing, you know when you start Dell Carnegie people tell you you're going to become a great leader. Um, even if you go look online, Dale Carnegie is associated with making great leaders. I think this is wrong. I do not think Dale Carnegie makes great leaders. I think that is, that is a side effect of what Dale Carnegie does. Dale Carnegie really makes people better people. Everything you learn in Dale Carnegie is not things that you just use in the workplace. There's things that you use at home in your everyday life. Um, I've learned a great deal about mutual respect and listening to people and understanding what they're saying and really listen to people. Don't just let them talk. That's probably the biggest thing I walked away with from here is I think before I would let people talk and not really listen to what they would say. I would just listen to them and then I would state my opinion and try to persuade them to go my route. It's not the right way to do this. People have great ideas and we need to listen to them. So I would really like to thank Del Carnegie for, yes, making me a better leader, but making me a better person. And I would highly recommend anybody that can to take this course. And if you can't take this course, find someone that's taken it and suck all of the knowledge out of them you can. So three to six months from today, I'm more assertive, I'm more confident, and I'm more understanding. That is what I will be in the next three to six months. Again, I'd like to thank all my classmates. You guys are awesome. I consider you all my friends now, and I look forward to keeping in contact with you. Um, Michelle, my instructor, you have been an awesome person, truly inspirational, and I really thank you for this opportunity, and I also would like to thank my organization for this opportunity, and I'm sure going forward that I will be able to be a better manager, a stronger leader, and a great person. Thank you very much.